forced to work under candlelight. In Lviv, residents are making do. 30% of the city is without power, caused by Russian missile strikes, which has been targeting Ukrainian infrastructure. You know, it is very hard, because yesterday there was no electricity in Lviv all day after the strike on the infrastructure of Lviv, and today there is no electricity either. It is very difficult to sell. There are no people. People left because they are scared. Indiscriminate strikes, which according to the UN, is a breach of human rights. Over 500 kilometers east of Lviv, Kyiv is also facing rolling power outages. The capital has been hit by Russian strikes for the first time in months, forcing residents underground, sheltering in the metro. Some have likened the strikes to the end of the world. It's like the apocalypse. There are no other words for it. It's terror and war against innocent civilians who have not expected this. This is horrible. People will need a lot of time, money, strength to fix it. And most importantly, they'll need to deal with psychological damage. According to Ukraine's energy minister, around a third of the energy infrastructure in Ukraine has been hit by Russian missiles since Monday. And as winter fast approaches, there are fears that the country will be inadequately equipped to cope with the cold weather.